Norwegian Forest Cat vs. Ragamuffin Cat What are the differences between these two cat breeds? The gentle and friendly Norwegian Forest Cat, WJ, for short, is fond of family members but does not demand constant attention and petting. These are big cats. Males can weigh 13 to 22 pounds or more, with females somewhat smaller. The WJ matures slowly and isn't full-grown until 5 years of age. The Ragamuffin is known for its docile nature. He loves to be held like a baby and will completely relax in your arms. Females usually weigh 10 to 15 pounds, and some males weigh more than 20 pounds. Norwegian Forest Cat is notable for its long, thick, beautiful coat and large size. The head has an inverted triangle shape, pointed at the chin and then widening on each side up toward the medium to large ears, which are heavily tufted. Large, almond-shaped eyes are green, gold, or copper, although white cats may have blue eyes or odd eyes. The moderately long body looks powerful with its broad chest and heavily muscled thighs. Large round paws have tufts of fur between the toes. The bushy tail is as long as the body. The weatherproof double coat varies in length. The bib begins with a short collar at the neck, mutton chops on the side, and a full frontal ruff. Full breeches, long hair on the thighs, cover the hind legs. On the body, the coat is long and flowing, but it changes with the seasons. A Ouija in summer looks relatively naked compared to his full winter glory. The coat comes in almost every color and pattern, with or without white, with the exceptions of chocolate, lavender, or lilac, or a pointed pattern like that of the Siamese. Ragamuffin's breed standard describes him as a cuddly feline teddy bear. He is characterized by his large size, large walnut-shaped eyes that can be any color, sweet expression, and variety of colors and patterns. One of the interesting facts about the breed is that kittens are born white, then develop their color or pattern as they mature. Some of the differences between the ragamuffin and the ragdoll are seen in the face. The ragamuffin has full cheeks and the eyes are walnut shaped rather than oval. Ragamuffin has a broad, modified wedge shaped head with a rounded appearance. It's supported by a short, heavy, strong neck that is especially apparent in males. Mature males are known for their jowls, giving them something of the look of a crusty old brigadier general. The broad chested body is muscular and heavy, often with a pad of fat on the lower abdomen. A long, fully furred tail looks as if it would make a nice, soft bottle brush. Medium to medium long fur is rabbit soft, dense and silky. It's slightly longer around the neck, on the sides and belly, and on the hind legs. The paws and ears are furnished with tufts of fur as well. The coat comes in every color and pattern. This is a large cat, and they mature slowly, not reaching their full size until they are 4 years old. The gentle and friendly Norwegian forest cat, WJ, for short, is fond of family members but does not demand constant attention and petting. He is satisfied to be in the same room with people and will entertain himself if no one is home. Although he appreciates the human company, he can be a bit reserved with visitors. Even with family, he's not much of a lap cat, but a nice scritch between the ears or beneath the chin is always welcome, and he'll usually reciprocate with a nice head butter cheek rub. He communicates with classic Scandinavian restraint. His quiet voice is employed only when he needs something dinner on time, perhaps, and rises only if he is ignored. This large and athletic cat is a climber. You will often find him at the highest point he can reach in the home, and unlike some cats, he doesn't have any qualms about descending trees or other heights headfirst. Thanks to his heritage as a wilderness and farm cat, not to mention his waterproof coat, the Ouija thinks nothing of fishing in a body of water for a nice meal. Aquarium and koi pond denizens, beware. While he loves the outdoors, he is content to live quietly in a home. This is a smart, independent cat who learns quickly and has an alert nature. He likes to play and thrives with a busy family that loves him. Ragamuffin is a huggable lug who wants nothing more than to follow his people around and sit in a lap whenever possible. A nice combination of sweet and smart, he is often described as a puppy-like for his friendly personality and willingness to play fetch, learn tricks and walk on a leash. He greets visitors warmly and would meet you at the door with a martini if only he had opposable thumbs. Ragamuffin is known for its docile nature. He loves to be held like a baby and will completely relax in your arms. Ragamuffins like to play but are good about limiting their attention to their toys and scratching posts, not your furniture. It is rare to non-existent for them to lay a claw on a person. This is a mellow cat but one who craves attention. Don't get a ragamuffin if you will have to leave him alone for many hours every day. Hello! This video is sponsored by Bmix Pets. Are you looking for high quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. Brush or comb the Norwegian forest cat's long coat once or twice a week, using a bristle brush, 
wire slicker brush, or stainless steel comb. If you run across tangles, work them out gently so you don't hurt the cat. A bath is rarely necessary, which is a good thing. With the Weejay's practically waterproof coat, it can be very difficult to get him wet enough for a bath. He is certainly built to survive a cold climate, but it's a good idea to keep a Norwegian forest cat as an indoor-only cat to protect him from diseases spread by other cats, attacks by dogs or coyotes, and the other dangers that face cats who go outdoors, such as being hit by a car. The ragamuffin soft coat is long, but its texture is tangle-resistant. Weekly brushing or combing is all that's needed to remove dead hairs and keep them looking beautiful. The ragamuffin has a fearless personality, so it's never a good idea to let him go outside. He has no notion that other people or animals might mean him harm and is not street smart in the least. Brush the teeth to prevent periodontal disease. Daily dental hygiene is best, but weekly brushing is better than nothing. Wipe the corners of the eyes daily with a soft, damp cloth to remove any discharge. Use a separate area of the cloth for each eye so you don't run the risk of spreading any infection. Check the ears weekly. If they look dirty, wipe them out with a cotton ball or soft damp cloth moistened with a 50 to 50 mixture of cider vinegar and warm water. Avoid using cotton swabs, which can damage the interior of the ear. Keep the litter box spotlessly clean. Like all cats, veggies are very particular about bathroom hygiene. A clean litter box will also help to keep their fur clean. Norwegian forests and ragamuffins who go outdoors also run the risk of being stolen by someone who would like to have such an unusual cat without paying for it. If possible, build them a large outdoor enclosure where he can enjoy the elements safely. The friendly, laid-back Norwegian forest cat is a perfect choice for families with children and cat-friendly dogs. He loves the attention he receives from children who treat him politely and with respect, and he doesn't mind playing dress-up or going for a ride in a baby buggy. The calm and even-tempered ragamuffin is an ideal family cat. He doesn't mind being held or carried around by a child or dressed up and pushed in a baby buggy. He is playful and smart, one of those cats who enjoys playing fetch and learning tricks, and his energy level means he won't wear out before the child does. Always teach children how to hold the cat properly, supporting both the hind end and the front end, and have little children pet him while they are sitting on the floor or on a sofa so they can be on the same level as the cat without trying to hold him. After all, he may weigh more than they do. They are also friendly toward other pets, including dogs, other cats, birds, rodents, and lizards. To this gentle giants, everyone is their friend. Nonetheless, it's always a good idea to introduce pets slowly and in controlled circumstances to ensure that they learn to get along together. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.